not just a separate entity. It's a part of your life. It's part of your culture. And everything in your life is going to change. I mean, when my kids were little, I played differently because I didn't have the same kind of time or I couldn't focus the same way. Now my kids are teenagers. They're off there. I can just focus on my music. You know, there's traditional prayers. And then there's also Debbie Friedman. And, you know, I love the traditional prayers. But her music is also becoming very popular. So there's a whole other spectrum of Jewish music that's uh, liturgical Jewish music. Wherever we were going, you know, if, Jew, if you're living in Africa, there's going to be African influence because you can't, avo if you're a musician, you can't avoid it. If you're living in South, South America, there's going to be influence there too because it's just, as a musician, you just pick up the sounds and it's impossible not to incorporate them in how you play.